Okay, hands up you guys, it is your girl, A Periods 101, and I'm back at it again with another video. <sighs> Ignore my foot, it's not moving, so I'll deal with it. <laughs> but yeah, so today I'm going to be showing you my tampon storage and... Wow, why does it always do this? Okay, sorry about that guys, my phone got a bit hot, so it... The flash went off basically because the phone was getting too hot. But yeah, this is where I keep my tampons. And it is in a drawer with a bunch of clothes. Or like, basically it's my pyjama drawer. But yeah, this is what we're looking for. So let's bring this out. Ooh. And it sits in this little corner back here. And I do actually have some maxi pads here that just couldn't fit. In this drawer where I keep my um pads so yeah but this is the basket it is almost 100% full and I still have more tampons to put in here but they couldn't fit so I've got them stopped away Ugh. Ugh. in there there's a big box back there 36 count and another box behind that one so yeah but here we go, so I have three different absorbencies in here. I don't have any like tampons. I don't own any. Um, I don't really need to because I feel like the regular ones are small enough. You'll see them when I get there. But um, I have all my super plus tampons, all my super tampons here, and then all my regular tampons here. One thing I want to say is that I will experiment with pads. I will experiment with them, them any fucking day. Tampons, I do not experiment with it. I just don't know why. I just have a fear of I don't know, I just don't like experiment with it. Exper <laughs> I can't speak. I just don't like experimenting with them. I found the product that I like. Thankfully this was the first brand of tampon that I tried and I just loved them and fell in fucking love and I've been using them for the past four years straight and it I've had no issues. So yeah my tampon storage is no is there's no variety like it's literally just all the same products in different abundances well, that's it it's not that interesting but i thought i'd show you guys regardless so mini run over <laughs> here in the corner i have my only full size tampons and these are still tampax but they're just the full size ones so these are the tampax pearl super plus and i don't i do have an open one somewhere here it is oh. this is what they look like Pretty self explanatory, yeah. Moving on to my other super plus tampons, all these orange ones here are super plus, so majority of them are super plus, as you can see. Like half of it is super plus because that's what my period is five days of the week that I'm on it, but yeah. So these are the Tampax Compact Pearl super plus tampons and this is what they look like so the applicator is dark blue um this is what they look like they're pretty much the same just smaller and you click them so that's it unclicked and then you just click it and then you insert it and you push it up just like oh just like you would any other tampon so yeah then moving over here i have my supers i just want to say this packaging is the new packaging as I've got the old packaging for these supers, but sorry, I thought somebody was coming into my room. Um, so yeah, these are the Tampax Compact Pearl Super. I was gonna say Super Plus. No, these are the Tampax Compact Pearl Supers. It's the new packaging, and then this is the old packaging. So yeah, but this is what they look like. So they are just slightly, ever, ever, ever so slightly smaller than the Super Plus ones. But yeah, this is what they look like. And then the last tampons that I have are the Tampax Compact Pearl Regulars. So literally guys, like I said, no difference. Same tampon, apart from these ones, just different absorbencies. There's three absorbencies, Regular, Super and Super Plus, and I have all three of them. There's nothing interesting here, but I thought I'd show you anyways. So, yep, and this is what the regulars look like. This is what I was talking about, about them being super tiny. Oh, my God. I use these for 
on my last day like on my last day and on my first day of my period and then if it's summer and it's like really really hot and i don't want to have a panty liner then i use this um instead of using a panty liner if i really 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 want to stay dry like all day but yeah these are my nails just thought i'd show you but yeah, that is it, literally. My tampon storage is nothing interesting, unlike my pad storage, which you guys have all seen before. Interesting, colourful, vibrant, different brands, different this, different that. Tampons, nah. I do want to work on um, improving, like, trying to work with different brands, but, you know, it might take a while. But for now, yeah, this is what it looks like. It'll probably only get bigger with these same products. It's not going to change, but... Yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, comment down below any other video ideas you guys want me to do. Whether it's um, hauls or... Because I went on a big haul today, but I didn't film it because that was stress. And I didn't think you guys would really want it. But if you want hauls, comment down below. Anything you want, I got you. Sis, comment down below. Advice videos, comment down below. Anything you want, comment down below. <laughs> Uh, I'm so tired. That's why I have all this energy right now because I need to sleep. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Please like, subscribe, repeat, and I will see y'all in my next video. Bye, guys. Love you. Peace.